I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't never had like no big brother to like come outside and like fight for me or come outside and do not so everything I had to do it on my own. Everything I did did it on my own. Self me, my own man. Shout out my man bro, I ain't gonna lie, he definitely out raising it on the father too. But other than that, ain't no problem. My own man self me, so everything. I never see this shit. Different me, I different him. You feel me? You gotta like, cause I know you gotta bump your head, especially with no guidance. That probably was the hardest part, like jumping shit out there on some. Like, shit got beat, not only me, like, you feel me? I had, it was early, too. I was young, I was in the eighth grade. You know, I started getting some real money, I was in the eighth grade. I dropped out of school in, in ninth grade, you feel me? Getting some money, I should sit, man. This school shit ain't what it is, bro, you feel me? I gotta get me some money, man. Dude's hurt, you feel me? Lights man, all uh, keep sending vision notices, all uh, Then I'm looking at the vision notice, that shit petty money to me. That shit four or five hundred, you feel me? So, ever since I've been, you feel me, in the streets, there ain't been no vision notices, you feel me? We ain't doing that. But yeah, that was the hardest part, though. No guidance. I ain't had no, like I said, I ain't had no big brother. My father was locked up, my father got locked up when I was two years old. Everything that I did or I learned how to do it, it was from my brothers or from what I learned, you feel me? Hold on real quick. It was from my brothers or what I didn't did. Or, you coming out here figuring it out by yourself. You take a risk every day type shit. Just being out here. How you gonna flip that into something else more positive? You ain't gotta be in the streets. That's why I try to stick with this music. Like, hopefully one day I can get a record deal. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't really begging no nigga. I ain't really, I ain't really doing you know, no extra shit. But you feel me? But I'm definitely gonna rip for it. You feel me? I'm definitely rip for it. That's why I jump in the music shit. Cause I'm like, the streets, you see if it's gonna take us out. Or we gonna go to jail. So it's like, I try to do something else that's going. You feel me? Get us out here. And I'm working on it. You feel me? The one thing we not going is to jail. It's music shit, that's our only hope. That's the only thing out. Nobody don't play no sports around here, nothing. The only thing we got is just music and the streets. Straight up, ain't nothing else. No jobs, no nothing going to do. We either going to die here, or we going to make it out. Straight up, no other way, man, or not. Got my niggas to back me up, though. I can't do it by myself. Gotta have them, you feel me? Gotta do this shit together. I ain't trying to leave them behind. I ain't trying to make it. I'm making it, and I ain't got my niggas. What the fuck? I'm gonna just be by myself. That shit fun. I'm trying to take my niggas with me. Round because it's been a fish. I done lost it all. I done lost it all. Hell of a time. Last week I fell off. Nigga, no. Use it all. We get it back. I got shot. May 11th. I got shot on my daughter's birthday. I lost everything. I was in the hospital. Ain't lying. That that hit me more than getting shot. Man, I know when I leave out there, I'm broke as shit. I ain't got nothing. I just lost everything. You know, police take everything. That shit was like ah. That shit. Yeah. It took a minute to shake back though, only because that shit was like with my mind a little bit. It wasn't even about no money. It was like, I know I'm gonna get some money. I was just trying to build myself. Like, I felt so like, like damn. Like, that shit hit me like, oh, you gotta stop lying. Boy, this ain't no joke. I knew she ain't no joke for real. I don't ever get a fuck. But I'm just saying though, like, I really like took shit for it. I really be grateful for what you got around. I almost lost me and my best friend. Shit. We're losing it all, I done lost it all. Like, giving people shit. Like, Doing more for people. I didn't put the streets before I didn't put my daughter no. I didn't I ain't never really been broke on clothes. It always been just giving or doing some shit. I know I ain't got no business doing trying to do some shit for a motherfucker. I know damn sure if I was in jail or something, you would not do half this shit I've been doing. No, for sure. It's okay with that though. I ain't no tech the tech person. I do that shit out of love. Your daughter they just waiting to see her daddy and shit and then like it was a situation. And what if I went to me, it'd have been like Man, that would have been sick as birthday. Every birthday, it would have been a year anniversary for me. That shit would have been fucked up. It's like it's like I'm doing the same shit my father did to me. Left me when I was two. You came back. I was sixteen. I was already in the streets, and all that. Yeah, yeah. Shit, you could do. Growing up without a father, how you think that affected you? I ain't gonna lie to you. I used to back in the day, like I used to like fight for love. I used to always want like, like even when homeboys, I used to always like try to prove to them that I was the Lord. Not just had to know like. You don't do shit like that's not how you get home. You gotta just be you, be cool. You know, real friends is gonna, it's gonna come with this shit. You gonna see me get old. It was way more people than us. It was a big ass crowd. This shit came down to this. That's going on. You feel me? Hope we don't go no more people, but it might get some more love. You feel me? I don't know my man. Big big dog. Dog. I can't forget about my man's B. Now I'm living my man 30 ball. You yeah, see that? Now I'm living my man 30, 30 ball. 30 ball. Man, keep on that big dog, yo. Straight up. Get back, ain't got no time on it. I lost my grandmother. I found my grandmother dead. My man lost his mother. Lie. I lost like, my family. mother, my grandmother, and my uncle. Only family my man got his strong, though. That's all. Only family my man got his strong. I put that shit on my back. Niggas, bro, I lost my grandmother. One thing we can see, yo, we all just with each other, yo. Learn me. 
If y'all just bitch with each other, rip with each other. We gonna make this shit happen, bro. We gonna get greedy later. It probably look rough now. This shit gonna get greedy later. I promise you. Look at my face when I'm telling you. This shit gonna get greedy later. I promise you. These niggas, look niggas the got their time now, bro. They with me when I lost my people. These the same niggas hey, that Mark, stuck around me. Me, I just, ayo, you know what's crazy? I just came from a funeral today. That's what took me so long to get to here. Lost my cousin, you know? How do y'all cope and deal with death? That, that shit just brings us closer. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I cried closer. one time. I mean, that shit. I used shit. to always cry. I ain't gonna lie. When, they, when, when you hear the name Big Doug, Big Doug died when I was booked. You know what I mean? That was my fucking nigga. Like to no violence or nothing. I ain't gonna lie. Big Doug was my nigga, like, down to the getting business, business together tip and Loyalty, you feel me? That was my motherfucking nigga. I ain't gonna lie to you. Let me yeah, show you some shit. First nigga to cop a chain. First nigga to cop a chain. Real shit. Chain. Me and you right there was the first young niggas running away with broke chains. We was young as shit. All together, that shit came under like 9,000 pointers. If you don't mind me asking, uh, you right here on your foot. What's your name? If you don't mind me asking, you said you had walked in and found your grandmother dead type okay. stuff. Yeah. What, how old was you and what was that like? That day for you, like, what I was, was your experience? I was 10. Me saying that, that was shit was like a shock in another lifetime. Like, you saying your best friend did, basically. You found me on the floor. Like, she ain't moving. So it's like, that shit, yeah, that shit explain itself. You feel me? Like, that shit a part of me. To this day, you know what I mean? Like, she made me, she made me who I am. Like, most of the time, niggas' mothers don't even be raising them, bro. It be grandmother. You feel me? Like, real shit, bro. Nigga, grandma be raising them niggas. So it was like. My mother and my uncle just passed away in November. Like last year. Shit, this nigga, nigga, strong. Bring us a lot of Let us know death. That shit ain't got no date. That shit any day, bro. Be here today, gone tomorrow. That's the scary part. What do y'all feel like people got mistaken about Baltimore? They always think we always on some robbing shit. They think we on some street robbing, killing shit all the time. They trying to get some money. We got street good talent here. Trying, we got good business here, good talent with all that shit. Niggas think we just straight on robbing, street killing. Like, we rob or we kill. They don't even give us a chance to show that we got talent. We got good rappers, singers, dirt bike riders, football players. Yeah. Like, all that shit get overlooked because they from Baltimore City. That shit phony. I don't like that shit. I don't that shit. Now, I will say that's what motherfuckers think of Baltimore. It's just, oh, yeah. it's just murder, 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 murder. murder. They tell you, you get if grimy you hear about yeah, Baltimore, oh, yeah, we don't give a fuck. You get grimy here. When I think, you don't get it right right up for the right reasons when I When I think of Baltimore, it's just, nigga, violence. It's the same city. I feel like it's the same way y'all think of Oakland. There's a reason behind everything. Get grimy for that paint, that check, right? They doing it. 